equivalent of UGAS-5. We have 14 new Halyon 1 instruments that are designed using the VST expression system, so you can get very, very expressive performances. We've also got uh, Garretton, uh, Vienna Symphonic Library, Sonic Reality. They're all going to be supporting the new VST expression system. So when you use samples from those libraries with QBS5, you will get the most expressive orchestral sign that it's possible to get in the sequence of the day. So it's really going to push ahead anyone who's using any kind of really expressive sound. It's a wonderful thing. And you can see here, in the editor, uh, we have different expressive stuff going on. Um, we've got open, dead, unit, flageolet, hammer, slide, arcano. All of these things now are really, really easy to get to. All right. What else we got? Moving right along. Batch export. Simple enough feature, but one that if you're, if you're archiving along, if you're moving your tracks along to a different DAW, we now have batch export. You can export all your tracks in one easy go, set up what you want to do, leave it, go get a cup of coffee, come back, everything's exported in a really good archiving format. Really speeds up the workflow. All right, and coming right after that, what we got? We now have a new tempo track, we have a new range track. Much easier to operate the temperature, uh, tempo and signature changes than we had before. Again, very useful if you're doing a lot of tempo changes. You just draw it in there on the track like you would any other controller down. Uh, new enhanced sample editor. The media bay has been improved. 